Transfer. I lost all of my money. Nice. You can't do that right now. I can't look at my inventory right now. And what ex... Can't fall off the path. Can I go backwards? Yes, I can. We should go towards the light. Can I run? Like, come on, game. Alright, go up the stairs. Where are we going? Hey, Johnny, what's up? It worked. I did it. Johnny, Monaco kept a word. Looking at you now reminds me of the moment we met. Still see that same small time mark, little thief with his head in the clouds. Haven't changed a bit. Epilogue. Seen plenty of Johnny Silverhand by now. And you know what? The whole pissed at the world rebel warrior front you got going. Not falling for it anymore. Anyway. Uncanny. Here I stand. Looking at an old pic of myself back in the day. Broke, halt, others. Abandoned them all. And now here's you, abandoning me. Abandoning yourself. Hmm? What the hell you mean by that? Biochip did more than just blend our memories. That line that kept V and Silver and separate, well, faded a while back. I'm still here. I know what I want and I know where I came from. I, I, I. Who's this I? You even know? Did what I set out to do. I'm the winner here. I'm bitter and sad. I guess that's who I am now. The V who chose to survive. What are you waiting for? I'm the V who chose to live. Same drive that kept Silverhand going his whole life. That drive in two thoughts. Never look back. Never look to those around you. Just keep moving. Look ahead. Stare death straight in the eye. You're not the only rebel around here. And I'm not the only one to have missed a bigger picture. We're a tangled web, you and me. One in the same. So if you're here to tell me something, it's because you need to hear it yourself. Well, time's sake, one part on good terms as friends. You want to part ways on good terms, Johnny. As friends. Not sure that's possible. Listen, I'm on an operating table getting sliced open. Our socket docks are taking the chip out as we speak. I mean, you knew it'd end this way. That the day would come when I'd want to be normal again. Want my life back. Normal is overrated. If it exists at all, they're cutting a piece of us out. And that'll leave a hole forever. Uh, cor Corpo. Things didn't go as Johnny planned. Wanted. So Johnny needs someone to blame. And pitied every little thing on Arasaka. Got old. A long, long time ago. Arasaka's got nothing to do with this. This is about trust. About who you're turning into. If you're all paranoid about being thrown in another Arasaka prison, don't be. They're gonna shred you. You're never gonna get it. It's not about our saga. Not even about life and death. Then what's it all about, Johnny? Enlighten me. The principle, V. It's always about the principle. 
Swap meat for chrome, live a BD fantasy, whatever. But at the end of it all, it's the code you live by that defines who you are. Ever get lost? It shows you the way home. Bust up into pieces? It puts you back together again. That rocker boy Silverhand's credo? Words he lived by? Something Johnny picked up from V. The old V. I don't want to drag this out. Just... See you around, Johnny. And thanks. For everything. If not for you, I'd be long dead. Several times over. Goodbye, Mr. Wick. Or is it Mr. Anderson? Remember what Dex hm. asked you? Quiet life or blaze of glory? Sure, I remember. Shame you chose wrong. Damn shame. In addition, numerous brain functions remain dormant. The neural impulses have been rerouted to the neural processor, a temporary measure. When can I expect a full report? I will send it by the end of this week. My congratulations again on your success. Goodbye. Please prepare the patient's room. What? Where's Johnny? The construct has been cleared from all engrams. The madness is past. So? We shredded him, as agreed. I'm... I'm hearing... Purple. Purple? What, what the...? The synesthesia is temporary. We had to create additional synapses in your brain. I think I'm gonna be sick. Having... Trouble remembering. How I got here. Some memories you have lost permanently. Others will return in time. You must stay calm. Your neural processor is overburdened. Any unnecessary stress response will only make things worse. Am... Am I still V? I... I died. Twice, I... Everything is in order. No. I... Who am I? Please take the patient away. Notepad. Progression and its further trajectory remain unclear. Removing the tumors proved a difficult task. Tumor? But the operation on the engram was the real challenge. Let's go. Is the ship of Theseus, dismantled into component parts and reassembled, still the same ship? We Wait, where the hell am I? The first to ever when separate them into a joint twin. Yes. I hear the cuckoo calling and long for Kyoto. Uh, are we in space? Please rest. A doctor will be with you shortly. Yeah, where is my mind? Go to sleep. Look in the mirror. Oh, what am I going to see? Can't make silly faces? Alright. So I'm going to assume the walls are not supposed to be purple. Like that's intentional, not a bug. So when I'm fully rested, it should go away, theoretically. Right, go to sleep. It's me. Come here. Uh oh. Oh damn you, Johnny. Okay, the purple's Waiting gone away. You.
investigate the noise. Whoa. Oh. Yeah, I can totally breathe in space. の Today is truly a historic day. Oh, jeez. He's alive again. Oh, hi there. Who are you, anyway? Oh. Please get ready. Testing will begin shortly. No, good morning. No, got some good news for you. We must complete a series of tests. Please do not hinder or delay. And the purple's back. Please use your Kiroshi scanner and read the displayed text. And it was a sight to behold, he said, how a soul would choose its life. Sometimes pitiable, sometimes laughable, at times wonderful and strange. That's enough. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Uh. Okay, just keep pressing F. Please link yourself to the device. Higher order representation formation initiating test. The patient is ready to be examined. Higher order representation what? Engram surgery carries an elevated risk of the onset of personality disorder. The test is essential. What are these tests meant to test? Initiate device calibration. Respond to the keywords. No thinking, just the first word that comes to mind. Journey. Uh, adventure? Life? Life. Home. Um, city. The city. Enemy. Uh,. Principal. Principal. Me. Betrayal. I don't know.
You're in a cornfield. Tall, green plants as far as the eye can see. The sun is bright, blinding. The stalks of corn part as you walk forward. You come across a clearing left by an automated combine in its wake. What's this test for anyway? It tests your level of empathy. The heat has made your mouth dry and sticky. You spot a rodent's nest at your feet. The machine has torn through the soft soil. You spot blind, newborn field mice around their mother. The machine has left her sliced in two. They lie in perfect symmetry, a tiny rodent rosette. Your mouth begins to water. What's wrong with me? A shadow gradually falls over the ground. The first rain cloud of the year. Hmm. Yes, right. Where are you going with this? Measurements complete. How'd I do? Not asking me Wait, how I see? feel about the cornfield and the mice. Step onto the treadmill. Like I was imagining that opening scene in Interstellar. Or one of them anyway. Motor function test. Please connect to the device. What's this test all about? Let's work out. Please walk. Gradually accelerate. How am I doing? Please control your breathing. Accelerate by three. Oh. Get up. Johnny's still here. You can't stay here. All right. Let's go in here. Where are we anyway? What is going on? Welcome to N54 News. I'm Jillian Jordan. The world remains gripped by the revelation that Saburo Arasaka has returned from the dead in the body of his son, Yorinobu Arasaka. A letter of protest regarding the apparent resurrection has been signed by religious leaders, human rights groups, and Virtue 100 company CEOs. This is an abomination born of unchecked vanity, technocratic arrogance, Complete moral collapse. Our position is clear. Suburo Arasaka's seizure of power is in violation of international law. International arbitration is absolutely necessary to... Do we really want to live in a world where the rich and powerful can become immortal? Where they can continue to take from the poor? Not only their livelihoods, but even their bu... You are gods! You are gods! You are gods! You are gods! Life is not for trade! Life is not... But Saburo Arasaka has issued his response in similarly strong terms. There will be no appeasement. Arasaka Shanaibu no dekigoto ni kanshite. Gaibu no katagata ni toyakaku iwareru suji ai wa arimasen. Seiyo ukeru koto ni kyoka ga hishiyo nai ijo. よみがえることも同様であると考えるべきです。私が息子を殺めたなどという主張は事実無根。法的根拠もありません。合意の上での身体の譲与は一種の寄付に分類することができ。殺人には到底値しません。殺人の条件は
生物学的な死です見ての通りこの体は Okay, another test. Any results from the tests you already did? No, we are not done yet. Today we begin a new series of tests. Fine. Hit me. Let's get this done. Cognitive function test. This again? Solve the cube. Next test, please connect your personal link. I only twisted it four times. What kind of test is that? Presentation formation, initiating test. The patient is ready to be examined. Yeah, I want to ask that. Why can't I solve the fucking cube? That is what I'm trying to determine. What? You pull it away after four twists. Same thing. Again. We need very precise data. Let's start this thing. Device calibration. Okay, so what it exactly is going on? Keyword with your initial association. As quick as I can, no thinking, got it. Illness. Death? Death. Rebellion. No association. I, me. Uh, solitude? Solitude. The present. Uh, an ocean? No. I don't know. The future. Uh, the city. You're in a cornfield. Tall green plants as far as the eye can see. The sun is in your eyes, bright, blinding. The stalks of corn part as you walk forward. You come across a clearing left by an automated combine in its wake. The heat's made your mouth dry and sticky. You spot a rodent's nest at your feet. The machine is torn through the soft soil. You spot blind, newborn field mice around their mother. The machine has left her sliced in two. They lie in perfect symmetry, a tiny rodent rosette. Your mouth begins to water. The shadow gradually covers the ground, the first rain cloud of the year. Measurements complete. We will now move on to the motor function test. It's again? Please step onto the treadmill. Okay, what exactly are they testing for? Motor function test. Personal link. Really aced it last time, didn't I? Slow walk. Stay silent. Bad so far, huh? Try a little faster. Accelerate by three. I, I can't. Gotta stop. Not treadmill. Hmm. Testing concluded for today. Communications have been unlocked. You may now phone home. Earth. All people close to you. Where's the phone? Where's the map? I can't find the phone without the map. Damn. Oh, there you are. How do I call home? Fire extinguisher? 
television. So I'm allowed to phone home, but... Okay, so I have to go out here to phone home. Wait, so where's the phone? Can't even find the... F oh my god. Unless that's the phone. The Odyssey. I seriously cannot find the phone. Like, seriously, where is it? Where do I jack in? No? Oh, this game is making me feel stupid. I can't find the phone. It's a jump rope. Ventil that's ventilation. You know, I am feeling really stupid right now. Like, I can't find the phone. That's the oxygen system. Yeah, I can't find it. Or is there really no phone in here? And... Arasaka is just messing with me. What the hell? Yeah, I'm feeling really stupid. It, either there is a phone in here or Arasaka is fucking with me and there is no phone. Or, wait. Apparently I can do that. Can I don't have access to the map. Oh! Jesus Christ. Yeah, so I am stupid. Can't do text messages. It's called Pan Am. Hey. Wow, it's been a while since I heard that voice. Listen, I'm I'm stuck in a shithole. It sucks hard. So leave the shithole. Come home. It's not that simple. No is a nice word. Beautiful sometimes. You should use it more often. Sorry, Mitch is about to blow a fuse. I'll have to call you back. Okay, call someone else. How's it going? Hey, think I ought to ask you the same. Got rid of the biochip. Arasaka do it? Yeah. Sitting on their orbital station. All right. So once you get back, pay me a visit, huh? You're gonna need a thorough checkup. How's Misty? Well, after you left, she went off to visit her folks. For a while, most likely. Got a postcard from her, from Warsaw. There's a polar bear on it. Tell her I said hi when she gets back. You'll tell her yourself. Yeah, so, to be honest, been better. What am I supposed to do long distance over the phone? I just wanted to talk, Vic. <sighs> Look, we go back long enough that you know I'm no good at this stuff. And Misty's out of town. What am I supposed to do? Get a grip. Make a decision. You already showed yourself and me you can do it. Yeah. Thanks for the pep talk, Vic. Sounds like a plan. Uh, code's not answering. Okay. So yeah, that was re like really stupid of me. I had to press T to access my phone. There wasn't like a phone in the room itself. How brilliant I am. Oh, here we go. 
Better vision. Less purple. No hello, no good morning. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. One, two, three, four. Hey, why isn't it going? Oh wow, really? <laughs> what the hell? Okay, so that was a dream. Is this a dream? leadership following his father's death and accused Militech of his murder. However, in an unexpected shift, the return of Saburo Arasaka appears to have diffused the situation between the rival mega corporations. この言葉を忘れ、焦って変化を求めすぎました。私が敵味方両者に解き続けてきた教訓。完璧なものを変える必要はない。これが真理なのです。以上となります。Saburo Arasaka and NUS President Rosalind Myers have agreed to meet in person to lay the groundwork for a lasting peace. A first step of goodwill was taken today as the Arasaka CEO withdrew from Night City 15 armored vehicles from the company. Stay silent. Let's do this again. Okay, this is definitely not a dream. We're recovering. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. One. What? Boost it up. Respond to the key words. No thinking, just the first word that comes to mind. Loyalty. No idea. respond to each term with the first thing that comes to mind. Quick as I can, no thinking, right? Humanity. Me. Please step onto the treadmill. Hmm. as you can without thinking about it. V. Hanako Arisaka. Want to talk to her now. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Solve it. Solve. I think we got it. I think. No. Yes. Shit, it worked. What now? Good morning. Please get up. expect to see you here of all people huh. life is full of surprises reprehensible place I hate it it could drive one insane what do you want they asked me to speak to you 
Wondering why they send you of all people. I am the bearer of bad news. Bad enough that it should come from someone you know. Uh oh. As it turns out, I'm the only familiar face for thousands of miles around. As it turns out, I really did die and go to hell. Listen to me. The procedure was a success. We removed the biochip. But the damage it wrought proved enormous. At the genetic level, altered DNA. The kind you would find in those suffering from radiation sickness. And sadly, it's lethal. Fuck. Fuck! Things are bad, yes, but we have not given up. All the options have yet to be exhausted. Want to talk to Hanako Arisaka? I'm afraid that's impossible. We had a deal. And both sides fulfilled their respective ends. You, your case, your troubles, no longer interest Hanako. Hanako Arisaka promised to save my life. Precisely why she sent me here to discuss your options with you. How much time I got? Approximately six months. Then things will deteriorate quickly. The time before your ultimate demise will be worst. Most taxing. What other options are there? I've already gone under the knife once. Arasaka Corporation has the capability to cheat death. All we require from you is a dose of trust. Trusted you once already. Fat lot of good that did me. You may join our pilot program. Secure your soul. I fear your body is no longer of any use. You must abandon it. We will create an engram of your mind and store it in Mikoshi. Store it? Why can't I just get a new body? We have yet to solve the compatibility issue. Doesn't sound like you had much of a problem with Saburu Arasaka. You have no offspring. Nor do you have an entire clinic focused solely on your care. How am I supposed to know this isn't another one of your tricks? A trick? Maybe Arasaka just wants to punish a pain in the ass thief. Maybe Saburo just wants another soul in his collection. The Arasakas have become gods. You are nothing to them. Insignificant. So this has to be your sweet revenge. Look at you. Your life's work has turned Saburo into a god. Yet here you stand, a mere mortal. That would make two of us. Why would I seek to punish my companion in distress? My employer has made you an offer. We should finish discussing it. So let's say I agree. I'll land in Arasaka's soul prison. Put myself at their mercy. Do I even need to ask about the catch? All is set forth in a contract, guaranteed therein. You must merely sign it. If you wish to live, that is. Now, since a digitized psyche is not legally an individual, the contract entails relinquishing your rights. A temporary measure, naturally. No, not about to become the property of our Osaka Corp. Current participants of the program are all well-known, influential people. We have yet to receive any complaints. And if I refuse? Your belongings are packed. A shuttle will take you back to Earth, and you will be dead before winter. It's no easy decision, I know. You should think it through carefully. Make your final decision. There are no legal loopholes, no fine print. You have nothing to fear. Cooperation agreement here in after referred to as the agreement is entered into on blank by I'm reading the contract. I always read the contract even though it's a fucking game. Authorized by the uh, Saka Corporation on the basis of power of attorney. They possess the right to terminate the engram created on the basis of their brain 
therein after referred to us as the engram. Wait, so you have the right to terminate me, basically. You, you shut the fuck up, let me read this contract. No copy of the engram beyond the original created by Arasaka Corp will exist. So there's only going to be one, okay? The engram is not encumbered by any third party rights, in particular the right of other persons to its temporary or perpetual use. So third parties are allowed to use it however they please. The agreement stipulates the rights and obligations the seller... I can't scroll down. Like I can't even read the full fucking contract. So you know what? I'm refusing to sign it. Made my decision. I'm going back to Earth. Going home. You will die there. Goodbye, Anders. You're awful as shit. But in making it, you gave me something better. What are you talking about? Before, death was inevitable. A fact of my shit life. You let me choose it. Accept it on my terms. All right, let's go home. What is this anyway? Take cube. Yeah, let's take the cube. Bye-bye. Wish they would let me see the rest of the contract. the earth looking from way up there she is pretty as they say or is that just another lie listen don't forget your implants were made for earth gravity could start acting up in orbit what i'm trying to say is don't ignore any error warnings okay and when you're back i mean if you come back i'll do a full checkup maybe even give you a little discount Take care, V. Um... Hey, V. I was just wondering how you've been. Haven't heard from you in a while. Still living large in Night City? 
I don't know. All I think about is dropping everything and leaving. <laughs> Yet, here I am still. Well, the city's like quicksand. The more you try to get out, the more it pulls you in. Once you're up to your knees, you're never getting out. Like, I'm like Evelyn. Anyway, look out for yourself, okay? And call me sometime. Bye. Hey, V. It's Pan Am. Remember me? The one with the car? Listen, you wouldn't happen to have any gigs to spare, would you? I'm not picky or anything. I'll take whatever pays the rent. If you've got something, or if you know someone who does, give me a call, okay? I really appreciate it. So, yeah, the, that's it. Catch you sometime in the afterlife, maybe. Hello, V. Um, Salt speaking. Heard about something big happening in Night City. With a certain V. Role. Um, don't know what that was all about or what you got going on. But if you ever need a hand, our camp's your second home. I will never forget what you did for us and for me. It's a debt I'm happy to owe you. Head up, eyes forward, V. V, hey! Can you hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Okay, well, all of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by. We can get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raven ship. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, V. Don't know what you got on your plate right now, but remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now, take care. Gotta hand it to you, V. I'm impressed. When you told me you were gonna go after Hellman, I was sure you'd come back as a garbage bag full of smithereens. But you did it. I'm not usually wrong about people and what they're capable of. I'm curious to see what else you've got in you. If you're looking for your next job, you know where to find me. Hello, V. From what I understand, you have less than six months to live. I do not know how you plan to spend this time. Perhaps you have chosen to put your feet up, rest, ponder life's meaning. Or perhaps you continue to do what you are good at. If that is the case, my father and I would gladly retain your services. You would be compensated generously. Six months will pass faster than you imagine. It would be a shame to let this time go to waste. Hey V, orbital connections cost an arm and a leg, so I'll just get right to it. I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot and... Oh dear. The Fool, the Moon, the High Priestess. Those, uh, those are bad cards. Keep a close eye on your new friends, V. I mean it. That's it? Hmm. Alright, so it was a fun game. Honestly, the main story is like really, really short. Like even though I played like maybe 30 hours, like it just feels really short. Like I, I could have probably filled it in with several more side jobs, but like I figured I might as well just end it. And then the that ending, it's like really, really long for an ending. You know what I mean? And there's, of course, there's a lot of bugs. You've seen it in this playthrough. You've seen me struggling with it. Uh, there was the FOV bug that I experienced earlier. 
And what else? I mean, I don't really have that much to say. I did have fun with it. I, I thought it was really fun when the game worked. Like, there's a lot of bugs. Most of them were just minor. But there are a few, like, the, a little bit major bugs here and there sprinkled around. But most of the bugs people complain about are really just minor bugs. And, of course, they really need do need to be fixed. But anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed watching this playthrough. I mean, there's not really much else to say. Like, I don't want to be one of those guys who just, like, hated the game. Absolutely, like, hate the game. Like, you know how salty people are with this game? Like, I'm not one of them. Hey, wait, Hideo Kojima? He made a special appearance. I didn't even see him in the game. But anyway, yeah, I don't want to be one of those salty people who just complains all the game all the damn time. There are lots of legitimate criticisms, but I get the feeling that a lot of people who hate the game are just hating on the game just to look cool. You know what I mean? Like, it really is a fun game and good game, albeit a little bit short. At least the main story was very short. That's what I didn't like about it. But other than that, overall, I did like the game. And I guess that's all I want to say. So, thank you all for watching this. If you liked it, please give it a like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more of this. And until next time, I will see you in the next game.